Tesla has recalled again, and this time my car is also on the recall list. Don't rush to blame. Today, let me tell you a heart-wrenching fact. The more you scold, the more vehemently you scold, the more people are actually being manipulated. Instead, it exposes Tesla's tactic of spending nothing but still making headlines every day. Today, I want to analyze three facts, and you guys help me see if this makes sense. First, why is Tesla reported every day when there are so many traffic accidents happening nationwide, including accidents involving new energy vehicles? Second, despite Tesla winning many lawsuits in the past, and even with results from third-party testing organizations, why does the public opinion continue to criticize Tesla? Third, isn't the subsidy for new energy vehicles about to end? Raw material prices are rising, but Tesla's prices continue to drop. When it comes to sales volume, Tesla indeed can't compete head-to-head -head with traditional brands like Volkswagen and Toyota. However, when it comes to being a topic of discussion, Tesla can be said to dominate the entire industry, leading by a significant margin. In fact, expanding the influence of public opinion to defend its own interests is understandable. If I were in their shoes, I'd want the whole world to know if someone damaged my reputation. But we must not let some ulterior motives from certain groups dictate the narrative. If they cry wolf every day eventually, when the real wolf appears, no one will believe them. At that point, who ends up losing? It's worth giving it some serious thought. 